Not hot enough. Not hot enough. Damn it, not hot enough. Wait, what's this? Oh, hell yeah! Hey guys, this is Versa from Game Exterior. In today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how simple it is to play System Shock 2 on LAN or take that LAN and put it online. Now, for all purposes, you do have to do something called the disconnect trick. Even if you're doing True LAN, even if you're using Tungle or whatever VPN gaming program, you have to do the disconnect trick. Otherwise, the game will not recognize that the IP address that you want it to use. So what is the disconnect trick? Well, first of all, here I am inside the Tungle room. And if you go to the more info section, I do have a link, or you can click on the wiki here that shows you this master, this really great System Shock 2 website that shows you a FAQ on the patches you need to download and get your game up to speed. Okay, so let's go to control panel. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to network settings. So network is going to be here, network and sharing center. And then you go ahead on the left hand side, click on change adapter settings. And here I'm going to right click on my wireless adapter or your ethernet and click on disable. Now. As an alternative, what you could do is physically disconnect the cable from the back of your PC or physically disconnect your wireless dongle by removing it from the USB um, port there. So now what you're going to do is literally start your game. So with that said, let's jump straight into the gameplay video tutorial. All right, so here we are at the main menu of System Shock 2. So what I, what I want you to do right now is literally Alt-Tab back to your desktop and re-enable your internet connection or plug it back into your computer, your Ethernet or wireless card, and then go back to the main menu. So after you've done that, now go to multiplayer, and then go to host a game, for example, click on next, and then if life is good, you should see your Tungle IP address here, or your real LAN address, or whatever IP address that you're looking for, and then click on next, and the client should also do the same thing. So my laptop ready did the disconnect trick, he's going to join, he's typing in my IP address right now and he will be here momentarily. Booyah! That's what I'm talking about. So I click on next and then I say start a new game or load a save game. So I'm going to start a new game because I don't have any saved games right now. And I'm get—I'm actually getting back into System Shock 2 so if you want to play let me know. I'm all about playing old school games online. I love it. Sweet. Welcome so we are the in the game. That's awesome. Facility. Please now, on my laptop, I am in the same room, but I don't hall, know just you yet, you know, it's been such a while, I have no idea Please how to, to um, chat, but I'm sure later on in the game that we can meet up and actually have a lot of good times. Step so that the is the game tutorial in a nutshell. If you like this type of video, please like, favorite, and subscribe so that hopefully one day we can get to the front page of YouTube. Otherwise, if you got any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on YouTube page and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.